What's up everyone? Welcome back to One Strange Adventure and welcome to the next video. Today's video, we're going to be dewinterizing our grand design reflection. I couldn't be happier. We're getting ready to go on our first adventure of 2020 in the RV. And so let me take you uh, through the steps that I take to make sure that this thing is ready to go. Let's go. What we're going to do first of all is actually fill up our freshwater tank and we're going to put in some bleach so that we can uh, sanitize the lines and everything that's in the camper currently. Uh, we're going to fill the freshwater tank all the way up and then we're going to run it through our faucets until we don't see pink anymore and we start smelling bleach uh, through each of those faucets. Alrighty guys, so in the grand design uh, you actually have some settings right here. Um, one of them says sanitize, and that's siphon to the tank uh, via the pump. And so that will bypass the hot water heater so that we don't put any bleach into the hot water heater. Um, and so I'm going to switch this now to match the pictures. I do like how Grand Design gives us a nice little colorful chart here to follow. So white down, blue down, black sideways, red sideways, green sideways, and now it is ready to uh, sanitize. All right, so we're gonna turn the pump on. All right guys, now that we've siphoned all the bleach into the tank, we're gonna go ahead and take the water hose and fill the tank up the rest of the way. Now we're gonna switch this over to power tank, uh, power fill tank, city inlet tank. And so white over, blue over, red up, green over. And that lets us fill the tank without having to use the pump. It goes directly into the tank fill, so. Got the hose connected, go turn that on. All right, so we got the fresh tank filling up now. Uh, we're gonna give that a few minutes, let it fill all the way up until it starts coming over into the, uh, the overflow and coming out so that I know that it is nice and full. And then we'll go back inside and we will run all of the faucets in the camper to make sure that we're getting all the pink out and we start to smell a little bit of bleach um, as the water is coming out. Once we're done with that, we're gonna let this sit overnight so that that bleach has a good time to, uh, a good amount of time to actually get in the lines and just kind of hang out there. And if there's any uh, gunk or anything built up in any of those lines, it can help break all that up. Uh, tomorrow we'll come back out and we will run, we will actually fill up the tank again um, and then run it through an entire cycle with fresh water so that all the bleach is gone. Well, it's not gonna be long of a wait for you guys. Uh, tomorrow is in three, two, one. All right, and we're back. Well, that bleach has been sitting in those pipes overnight. Uh, should be nice and sanitized now. And we're going to go ahead and run the lines a little bit more. And then we're gonna empty that tank and then we're gonna fill it back up and run the, all the water through the lines one more time and then empty the rest out of the tank and we will be ready to go. All right, now that we have um, ran all the water through the lines on the inside and the outside kitchen, we're gonna go over here and run it through the line that's in the water tank, or coming out of the water tank rather, and then we're gonna drain the fresh tank. Now that we've uh, drained all the water out of the fresh tank and we have shut that valve um, to close the fresh tank drain again, we can go ahead and fill it back up 
run the water through there until you don't smell any more bleach and then drain the tank uh, the rest of the way and put a little bit of water in there to go and we are ready to go. All right, well that does it. This camper is ready to go on our adventure this weekend and we will have good clean water uh, throughout the trip. So here are the steps that I took. You fill up the fresh tank, you put a little bleach in a bucket, a quarter cup for every 15 gallons. This camper has 60 gallons, so I did one cup of bleach. Uh, fill it up with water, mix it up a little bit, siphon it into the freshwater tank, run it through all the lines until all of the antifreeze is gone, and then you start smelling a little bit of bleach. Let it sit for 24 hours, come back the next day, run it through a little bit more, empty the fresh tank, fill the fresh tank back up, run it through all the lines again uh, until you don't smell bleach anymore. Then you dump that bad boy again, fill it up, run it through the lines, and you are ready to go. All right, so if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you really like that video and you wanna see more of our content, make sure you subscribe. And until the next strange adventure, keep making your own. Maybe this time.